I mean, he's, he has great acceleration. Uh, he's good in and out of his breaks. Uh, he has great hands. And he, and he runs good routes. You compare him to anybody else you've gone up against since you've been at LSU? Um, I've seen, uh, watching film, I've seen, you know, a little bit of Odell, you know, uh, in him kind of coming out of his breaks and the acceleration that he has. So. He's a kind of receiver where even if you have really good coverage, you can still make a play. That's how do you prepare for that mentally? And, you know, it's like you know you can do everything right and still figure out a way to catch the ball. Um, I mean, you know, just just gotta you know get prepared for it, for everything. I mean, um, I mean, of course he's you know probably one of the the best receivers we're gonna face all year. And um, I mean, he you know he he will make plays, but we're just gonna have to limit that number of plays. What do you do on those jump ball situations where the, it's like you're going for a rebound? He really excels at those. Um, just make sure that, you know, we're in great position, you know, try to uh, box him out and, you know, just, you know, make a play on it. Basketball rules. Yeah. <laughs> Chandler, what's the, what's the DB's confidence at this point in the season after kind of the last three games getting, getting back on schedule? Um, I feel like our confidence level is, you know, pretty high. Uh, I mean, we, we, uh, Stepped it up, you know, these past couple games, and um, you know, kind of shut down the Ole Miss offense. Um, so uh, I mean, we're we're feeling great. What all does the addition of, of Jamal Adams playing more, playing in different spots? What does that do for the defense? Um, I mean, that that just you know kind of builds his game, and then just kind of helps us out. Um, you know, missing Dwayne, um, he just kind of fills that spot. So uh, I mean, we're, we're really excited about it.